Well, well, well. I know a lot of y'all been upset, talking mess all over social media because y'all said I was late. Well, I'm here to tell y'all that I'm not late, first of all. And this is the late night special, okay? And it's very, very special because we have a oh, myself. Big cashmere. <laughs> and we also have her props. Her father. They we had to let them bond. Um, everybody don't want a camera all the way right in their face and all of that stuff. So we had to let them bond and that's what we let them do. So now we here to get you guys' questions out the way. You guys have lots of questions. Y'all are very nosy. And it's okay because Cash is here to be transparent. Um, first question out the gate. How did it feel to finally meet your daddy? <laughs> um, I was a little nervous, scared. I don't know. I don't know. Like, I don't know. <laughs> Cash is too much, y'all. <laughs> she. I don't know. I was scared. Like, I was nervous. I don't know. Like, oh my god. Okay, next question. How it feel to finally meet your it baby? It was great. It was great, and it's gonna continue to be great. As long as she continue to open the door, I'm here. That's why I see fit. That's why she see fit. That's a big ass joint you smoking, girl. Do you totally pop? I hear you, baby girl. Do what you do. Do what you do. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all, this is too cute for me. Y'all don't even know it's too cute. It's been a very emotional little time since they got here. Y'all, I was, I had to walk away cause I was about to cry. I was like, oh my gosh, like, ah. Like, you know, it's just, it's very cute. Um, so I'd already did some content with you um, and spoke with you like about a lot of the supporter questions and things like that. So we are not gonna get too much into that. Um, we're gonna let them, we're gonna let them go back and watch that cause that was a one-on-one. -on -one. Um, you guys will be seeing that after the live drops. So, Cash, is it anything like, you know, you want to talk to your daddy about? Get that shit off your chest. Um. I love you, man. I really just touch. got one, like, one question, like, that one, though, like, ooh, I dropped a blunt. Oh <laughs> Somebody fucking your nigga. Oh, my gosh, I dropped a blunt. Oh, my gosh, I got to call Rico. <laughs> <laughs> ooh, Rico, you better not, bro. Rico, I'm calling you after this. But one thing I got to ask my dad is, like, 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 spending all that time in jail, like, uh, <laughs> like, you know, like, not knowing me, like, how did that make you feel, like? Drove a nigga crazy. I mean, um, even if your mother did come see me and brought you up there, it still would have had an effect on me for not being there for you. Um, it was a failure. I mean, it was an embarrassment. Um, any man should feel the same that, any man should be able to feel the same period, no matter if he in prison or on the streets, not being there to protect his child, no matter if it's a boy or a girl. Um, it hurts. It still hurts. It's gonna always hurt, despite anything. Some say let things go, but at this moment I feel great, man, being in your presence. You're a beautiful young woman. On my soul. How old are you? I'm 48 years old. Your birthday? February 25th. My favorite color is green. Like the green she got? <laughs> yes, ma'am. <coughs> Money green. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Is it anything you want to ask me? Yes. How you, how you doing? <laughs> no, seriously, how you doing? What do you mean, how am I doing? Well, 
do you get some tranquility in your life sometimes, some peace? Uh, meaning? Peace, babe. Like, um, <laughs> just sometimes being alone by yourself and just, you know, reflecting on what you want to do in life and how you're going to do it, you know. And sometimes you reflect on the past, but sometimes best reflect on the future, you know, just solo. You might grab your drink and just sit back and reminisce on some good things, but also plan your future. Um... I don't know how to answer that. Don't worry about it. I got it. So, Cash, do your messy ass have peace? <laughs> Tell your daddy the truth. Do you have peace? Do you find time for yourself? Are you? Are there any? Are there any? Is there any time of the day where Cash has time for Cash to reevaluate her thoughts? Is your do your do your life stop at any time of the day? Yes. That's what peace is. Sometimes it's even going to the beach by yourself. Yes, yes, sir. Continue to get it, man. Um, don't let nothing that was hard on you affect your future. You didn't accomplish more things than a lot of people. You got to continue to keep going forward. Continue. Whatever they give you, you continue to build on it. You don't fucking stop. I don't give a fuck what it is. You don't fucking stop. You go hard, you stack your paper, and you go to the next level. Bank accounts for you know who I know, put it in the way for, and you keep going. Don't settle for nothing less. Don't settle for no broke ass nigga. Don't settle for no illiterate ass nigga either. Settle for something that's gonna be for you. That's gonna get you right. You can roll your eyes, you can look in the sky. You ain't talking about me here. I'm just saying period. Yeah, she gets sensitive when people talk does. about Rico. You yeah, can't you talk about Rico. You ain't know she cut me off for that one day. <laughs> oh. What? So said, y'all like cut him off. Like, so y'all were actually having conversations. Yeah, she cut me and off. And then she cut you off from right? Rico. Because I, I thought I was going to fuck his ass up. You want that fade from Rico? I'll take it right now. No, you won't. <laughs> I will help Rico. <laughs> it's my baby. I'm going to help Rico. You going to jump in? Yes, I'm going to help my man. Girl, let Rico catch his own fade. No. What? That's my man. No. That's my man. No. Not my man. No. It doesn't matter. I'm going to still love her regardless. He should ex ex expect that. Like I can't accept nothing that I ain't never saw. Well, that's my man. So. That's right. You happy? <laughs> yes, I'm happy. Right, and cool. I love him. And that's right. It's just that. That's right. <laughs> Girl. <laughs> <laughs> That's my man. Like, no, you can't fight him because your daughter loves him. I know. So it's like, it's more like you gotta just like, you know. Yeah. Maybe when I leave him, then you could like, you know. But as of now. Yeah. You can love him. That's your business. Yeah, that's right. I wouldn't fight your woman. No, I don't have no woman. I mean, if she disrespects you, then I get on that hook. I don't have no woman. Cash Daddy is single, y'all. Y'all caught that? Cash Daddy is single, y'all. He's not single. Then <laughs> <laughs> you hear about no. Yeah, you know, they were saying your daddy was fine. Yeah, no, like with extra spine. Extra so fine and fine. fine. I mean, you a cool old man. No shade. You a nice looking old man. I appreciate it, baby girl. You handsome. No shade. You <laughs> My daughter. Yeah. <laughs> I'm your daughter, bad. 100%. Bad. Bad. So, you guys have mentioned that, okay, so there, let's just clear things up. There has been some type of form of communication, but today was just the first time that you guys got to see each other in the flesh. Yeah. So, when um, we were all talking earlier, he had mentioned that you stood him up and he cried. Yes, I stood him up. Why? Because at first I felt like, okay, I'm gonna go see my dad. Okay, I was mad at my dad, like, I was mad at him for a long time for going to jail. Like, I was really like, you know, like, I was angry, like, you know, like, so I didn't really want to see him. I didn't really want to talk to him. Like, I didn't, like, 
I'm grown, so like not like that. I'm grown, so mm -hmm. I just was feeling like I don't need him right now. I don't, I don't need him right I now. Understand. Like not like that, but that's just how I felt. Like I don't, I don't need, I don't need you. I'm grown. Like when I needed you, you weren't there. Like you know what I'm saying. So like, I don't need you. Like so yeah, I stood him up because I just felt like it wasn't the right time. Like it, I was not ready to see him. Like you know, like this, you my baby was ready to see him, but I wasn't. Like you know, like no, like it just. It wasn't the right time, like, you know? Well, he said he didn't, well, you tell her. You tell her what you told me, how you felt. I cry like a baby, but I love you, despite whatever you feel. Um, even today, I'm, I'm willing to wait, you know, whenever you're ready to open up. But by you calling me, letting me know what's up today, I'm here. Um, I'm not perfect, I never was. Um, my leaving you was, Due to my they called you Mr. Clean. <laughs> I don't say what they say. I'm a grown man. Why you do it? Because I looked hey. at it and I took a sip and I, hey. I was about to laugh too. It and I didn't want to laugh. Why like you do that? <laughs> Mr. Like clean. <laughs> I can't help you. Look, you know the cold thing about it? Ooh, is that. <laughs> Okay, my Ooh, bad. Not too much on my no. daddy, bitch. <laughs> let, him, let him get on me. Let him, let him look. <laughs> Most of them don't even got their father. Period. So I, I, I can care less about what people say. Um, I'm just, like I said before, I'm just glad you opened up and let me come. You know, um, I love you, man. You know, I'm just trying to get it right. Period. Yeah. I love you too. Thank you, baby girl. That's beautiful. So, wait, can we get that lighter, please? Mm hmm Thank you. So, not only you had a daughter out here, but you got a grandbaby out here. Yeah. He also has two other daughters. daughters. Yeah, I have two other daughters. Yeah, we talked about them earlier. So, you left three, like, how many grandkids you got? I have four grandkids. Four grandkids and three daughters. Yes. And you have made it a point to reunite with all of them? No, at this point, um, I call them. Okay. I speak to one. I speak to Imani. My other one, um, she's living her life. Um, she has her own reasons why she's cool on me. So, you know, I'm not worried about it. I ain't going nowhere. I don't care where she at. I ain't going nowhere. You ain't going nowhere? And I'm not finna leave my kids. Fuck all that. I already did that. That shit old. That shit trash. That shit for them sucker niggas. I'm not finna leave my daughter. None of them. Even if they don't want me around. You know how many times I called Imani and she hung up on my face? Or she don't answer her phone? I still kept calling. I ain't finna just don't give a fuck. As long as she got a number on, I'm gonna get it. And if she don't want me to have it, I'm gonna find somebody don't else. Don't make it like I was just ignoring you. No, you you pissed me off. Of course I did. Right. Of course I did. Right. You pissed me off and yeah. I cut you off. Yeah. But I called you back when yes. I missed you. I said, hello, how you doing? You know? Yeah, I appreciate it. I'm going to say this, Cash. You're a little hard on your daddy. No, she But I, I understand. I'm a little hard on him? Just a little bit. Just a little bit. OK, let me take a shot, because it's time. Yeah. I'm a little hard on him? Just just a little bit. Just okay. a little bit. Just just okay. a little bit. Okay. You know? and. I, I get it though, because my mama had to put me in a closet because I was trying to fight my daddy. Like I was ready to, I thought I could take him, you know? Mm -hmm. But a lot of women, a lot of young girls, they don't got this opportunity and everybody gets to see you had this opportunity. Okay, but it's like, with me it's like, I just feel like I'm grown, Nitty. Mm -hmm. Like, I am grown. Grown so ass like, woman. I do, like, you know what I'm saying? So it's, it, I just feel like, yeah, he's here. But like, honestly, like, I don't know how to say this. Say it. And not say it in the way. Say it. Don't hold back. Say it. Honestly, like. Girl, you said worse shit. Yeah, but I don't want to, like, you know? Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Baby like, girl, say it. It doesn't matter. Say it. Get that shit out. Fuck me, whatever. I don't give a fuck. Say it. Get it out. 
Like you, you was gone my whole life. Exactly. Like, oh, exactly. It's like I'm grown. It's exactly. Like I don't, I, I, I don't know. I don't know. Exactly. Look. I don't know how to be nice. Like it's, I can't be nice. You don't like, have to. I can't. Just be you. Just be you, man. I'm gonna accept you for whatever. Because it's no excuse for what you did. You knew <laughs> what you had when you when you had it on the outs, but you still did what you did. So you didn't think about Imani, Rainisha, Alicia, when you was doing what you was doing. So I just feel like I shouldn't like I shouldn't have no sympathy. I shouldn't have no soft spot. Because you don't have a soft spot for us. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, that's just how I feel. Like Listen, everything you're saying is true. Um, politically correct, you're right. Um, my lifestyle growing up, I didn't have no sympathy for nobody. I didn't love nothing. Um, I did love my daughter, Rainisha, my first daughter. Um, life take you on a journey, Imani, uh, Cash. Life take you on a journey. Um, Sometimes when you caught up in the streets, you fucking caught up. And um, I was caught up. I'm not here to bash nobody. I did this to myself. Um, but I'm a whole new person. If you accept me, you accept me. If you feel you don't want to accept me, you don't have to, baby girl. But I ain't going nowhere. You know, I ain't going nowhere until the day they put me under the dirt. I ain't going nowhere. I love you, man. Anything you want to say to me, you feel it's fucked up or not, you speak that shit. We got the same blood, but you, you don't even know the other side of your family. You have no clue. You think you wild. <laughs> you have no clue. But I'm going to say this, man, I'm going to change, man, the best way I see fit. I'm going to love you and I'm going to love my grandkids. There's no excuse about why I left, you know? I'm not finna sit here and say, oh man, your mama knew what type of nigga she was fucking with. I'm not gonna blame her. She has nothing to do with this today. This, this, I did this. As a man, taking responsibility for my own actions, I did this. But it's just, you know, shit. <laughs> shit, I'm I went like... to the board and got a date and came home and I get to see you. I love you, man. Straight up. <laughs> Straight up. Bitch, that's love. I love my daddy too, but it's like. I feel like you just don't trust shit. I feel like you just, you just, you like, just unsure. Exactly. You unsure. And it ain't nothing wrong with feeling like that. Like, we all watch you. You feel me? And I had, and, I was on them too. Like, when you told me this was your daddy, I took it word that it was your daddy. Somebody else had called me like two, three weeks ago and they had tagged us in a post and they told me that they knew your daddy. And he was like, yeah, I'm right here with Cash Daddy. Woo -woo -woo. And I was like, oh yeah, okay. But I didn't act on it because, bitch, you know, I'm like, Cash ain't said her daddy got out of jail. Like, you feel me? So, it's like he taking the initiative and he trying, you feel me? But I know you see that, but you just like, what you niggas on type shit, right? Like on some shit, like, yeah, like, see like, my grandma, like she did what he was supposed to do. His witch is his mother, but she passed, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So it's like, I know like, you know, I know like, my dad, you know, he can have a good heart. Like, you know what I'm saying? It could, it could be like, then again, it's just like, I don't trust nobody, Liddy. I know. I don't trust this all. I know. Because you be coming at me crazy. And <laughs> not like that. Mm -hmm. This is my father, but I don't know him. Mm -hmm. So it just be like, I don't know. But you willing to get to know him though, right? No. <laughs> no. Cash. You're about to make me cry. I'm not. I'm just not. <laughs> like, 
You don't want to give him a chance. Hmm. No. Why? Because it's just like... Because he went to jail? Yeah. What if I was dead? That could fuck people up. Like, you know what I'm saying? I've been through a lot of shit, Liddy, and half of it is because of him. Because of him not being there, so... Like, you you give your mama a chance, no shade, and she do the <laughs> evil and shit. And this is your daddy. That's my mom. That's your daddy. That's my mom. mom. It's my mom. And yeah, my mom do evil shit to me, but my mom took care of me for my whole life. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, that's my mom. Like it's different. Like I don't know. It's just different. Like, and it's like, I don't know. Like, I just don't know. Like I just. Like, I was finna turn around, Liddy. I know you was, I stopped you. It's like. Because I just felt like, I don't know, like, if I didn't know if I was ready or if I was ready, if I wasn't ready, what it was, like, was, this is my, this is my father. And if something was to happen to my father, I will be like, you know, hurt and all that. But it's just like, he missed my whole life. Like, I am grown. I am 22 years old. Like, what's the point? Let me ask you something, Monty. You know how you be on these shows? I, call, I catch a glimpse of that little what you do. So, say you hit one of these girls and the girl die. Mm-hmm. And the show, the show gets sued and all that other crap. And they telling you, Here's, we're trying to give you 100 years. Here's a deal for 25 to life. Not like that, but. No you gonna shade. take it? I think you can die on that TV. <laughs> so, <laughs> so you take it, right? So you uh-huh. take it. Because you didn't, you, didn't, you didn't damn near kill. I didn't, I didn't call it a few glimpses. You got little hands on it. Uh-huh. So you, you kill one of these little sisters. And, um,. Baby girl growing up. Baby girl gonna be like, damn, my mama ain't been there for Please don't put me in your shoes. Just saying. Don't put me in your shoes. Just hypothetically speaking, baby girl. Don't put me in your shoes. So, it's a fucked up feeling, you know? It's, it's, a, it's, a, it's a fucked up feeling when um, you're, stuck in a, you're stuck in an era where you wanna see your child, you know? Like I said, it's a lot of things I don't say, a lot of things I'm not going to say. But um, you're right, I, I put these shoes on, you know. I just wish you, somebody would have brought you up here to see me, you know, out of 20-something years, you know. I would have loved to see you, you know. Maybe we could have got a relationship together. I don't know. A high and a buy, maybe a few hugs. Um, but I get it. I get it 100%. You don't wanna fuck with me? I show, hey, baby girl, that's your choice. I'ma still love you. I ain't going no fucking weird. I'm here to the end of time, baby girl, to one of these suck ass niggas out here kill. Like I said, you don't, you have no clue who your daddy is or your family. You know, I fucked up. I can't live in that past. I refuse to. I refuse to. So I'ma continue to move forward with you. If you like me or not, I'm not going nowhere. <laughs> I'm not going no motherfucking where. So it's it, baby. For real. This is it. I don't, I don't care what you say, man. I ain't going nowhere. I'm finna give up on you. You can say to the whole world, fuck but you. It's not me. It's I'm not giving you up giving on you, up. man. <laughs> it's you really can... not you giving up on, on me. It's me just thinking, like, it'll be a time for that. Like, you know what I'm saying? When you ready. You ready. Simple as that. Bottom line, when you read. It's like you was just in jail and I was never talking to you. I was talking to you every blue moon. Like, yes, you were. I was never talking to you. He man. said he wrote you while you were in juvie. He wrote me. So y'all was both locked up and y'all was writing each other. I still got the letters. I didn't him. You didn't write him back? I wrote him because my grandma made me. I, <laughs> when I did write him, my grandma made me write him. But just me on my own, I never did it. 
You're such a mean girl. I didn't feel like I needed to because I felt like. I'm first a of child. All, I'm not gonna lie. Any story I heard about this man, it was never good. It was never nothing like, okay, like, you know, your dad did this good, or your dad did this, or he had. To, it was always something bad that he did. It was never nothing good. So it was like, okay, this man is just like, you know, like, I never heard no good stories from about him. Like, never, ever. And then it's like I can't even think of one. My grandma told me like a good story. Like, you know what I'm saying? So it just be like. Hmm. Yeah, I love you. Yeah, but it's just like. It is what it is. You telling me my mother ain't said nothing good about me? I ain't gonna believe that. I never that. heard a good story about you. I'm not gonna believe that. I can't remember one. I promise you. <laughs> what did she tell you that was so bad about me? She never said nothing bad about you. I never said she said anything bad about you. But I never heard a good story. Like, that's what I'm saying. I was a bad dude. I can't help it. I was in survival mode from birth. What the fuck I supposed to do? I was in survival mode. I, I see didn't y'all know. bringing my mama up in the comments. Let me let y'all know something. This ain't about her. I don't got in heaven. And yes, my mama do shit. She do me she do me fucked up. She do me bad, but I love my mama dearly. So we ain't gonna make this about Lucretia. Okay? <laughs> Thank you. The fuck? We ain't gonna make this about her. Fuck her. You didn't have to say fuck your mama. Fuck though. her. Her too. Fuck that. She just did a motherfucking live on me. Shout out to that bitch. Fuck that hoe. On oh, my soul. Fuck them. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. On oh, my soul. I don't. I don't give a fuck. I know. I don't, maybe. I know. I know. So... Like, they both really got me fucked up on my side. They both really got me fucked up in a way, like, you and my mama. My mama got me fucked up because she just, she's back. I don't know what's wrong with this lady. Like, I can do nothing to her. I can be minding my business, living my fucking life. And this bitch is going to go on Instagram, and she's going to talk about me. She's going to bash me to the motherfucking world. She can be mad at this man. And guess what? She talking about cashmere. Talking about how I got my baby, fuck my baby, all this weird ass shit. You want to come on here and you want to act like you're just this good ass man and you're, you're not. You, you missed my whole fucking life. Fuck you too. I don't give a fuck about you neither. Oh my soul. You missed my whole fucking life. You missed my, fu- I went through so, many, so much shit because of you. Every time I got in trouble, it's because fuck your daddy. You remind me of your daddy. I hate you. I hate my mama. I hate both of y'all. I wish y'all could leave me the fuck alone. Like, I, I really hate y'all. Like, for real, for real. Like, I don't, I don't, I don't care. You, you're, nothing you do, and nothing you say gonna make me feel like you're, you're good to me or you're okay because you went to jail. And, no, fuck you. Fuck you. You missed my whole fucking life. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. You missed my whole fucking life. Fuck you. I hate you. The fuck? I hate you. I hate you. I hate you. From the bottom of my heart. I hate you. I hate my mama. I hate all y'all. Y'all make my life a miserable hell. Leave me the fuck alone. It's because of you. My mama disliked me. Because of everything you did. So I hate you. What did I do? I got my head cut, my hair cut off. I got beat. If you was there, my life probably would have been a little better. I probably wouldn't went through any, any nothing I went through. Fuck you. Money. Fuck you. Look, money. Fuck you. I get it. I hate you. I know. That's Fuck good. You. Never did Fuck that you. to your mother. You gave Rainisha a chance, not me. No. You was in Rainisha's life. No. You was in Alicia's no. life. No. You wasn't in mine. No. You wasn't in mine. Listen. Fuck you. Here. First Fuck and you. foremost. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. I don't give a fuck. Fuck you. Fuck you. For I don't sure. care. I hear you. You left me. Don't say you left Rainisha because you was in her life. Don't say you left Alicia because you had time to see who she was. No, I didn't. Alicia, you left me. Alicia was you born. You left me. I was two months. Mark, didn't then you was born. Like, you, okay. You're sick. Listen, no. You're sick. No. Okay. You're sick. Listen, you didn't no. care. Listen, you didn't listen. care. It wasn't about if I You didn't care. I was you didn't lost. care. I was if you streets. care, if you care, 
you would have you, you would have never went to jail. You didn't care. Okay, listen. I'm not. You know what? No, you right. You right. You right. I didn't care. I didn't care. Fuck I was you. wild in the streets. Yeah, fuck. Me. I was wild in the streets. Straight up, straight down. I was fucking minutes. You goddamn right. I was. I was fucked up in the streets. I don't care. But at the same, you don't have to care. Like, but at the same time, oh my so. At the same time, I love you. I don't give a fuck what you say. I listen, man. I don't care about I don't. That. I love you. I don't care what you say. No. I love you, so, man. You're my daughter, man. To no, the day you die. You can say what you want to say. You can feel how you want to feel, man. I, yes, I was in prison. I, I, I can't help all that's that. That's fake shit. Ain't nothing fake. Fake. Baby girl, you call me here. You don't give a fuck about this motherfucking show. I don't, I don't give a fuck about fuck this. I want to see my daughter. You, I want to see my motherfucking matter. daughter, man. That's all I cared about, matter. man. It don't matter. I don't care about all this other shit. I just want to see my fucking child, baby girl. That's all I wanted, man. See what you do, you know? Do what you say, man. I'm not going to stop you. I feel like, I feel like, listen, listen, listen. For sure. You yes, that's how you feel? I can't stop your trust on what you've been through. I don't know your life, Monty. I don't know. Nobody really was filling me in on what mm -hmm. you've been going through. Everything I'm hearing now is new. I don't know. Ain't nobody was fucking writing me, telling me what's going on with you, baby girl. All this shit I hear about the other day on the phone, about the shit you going through, I don't know about all this shit. So listen. Ain't nobody told me shit. Listen, listen. So, she just told you all of the shit that she been going through. You feel me? And this is her hurting. Like, like, no shade. Like, I know it's fucked up. But the same, the same energy she's projecting, a lot of us didn't already seen this. You get what I'm saying? And I know it hurt. I know it hurt. But I'm not no therapist, you feel me? I really wanted a, a nice reunification. And when you ready, Cash, to reunify with this man, when you ready, you do that. You feel me? You do that. And to you, don't give up on your baby. I like never you give up on my child. I don't, don't give a fuck what she say, man. Don't, I don't give a fuck what she say. Don't give up. That's my baby don't girl, man. Because she gonna come around. Because she came around with me. And I seen her come around with others. And I see her come around with her mom. It's just Look, you her daddy and, and she hurt. But I don't sure want she hurt. I don't I don't I don't I don't want it to to get too deep. Nah, like man. you feel me? Nah, for I this. Wanna... So what I encourage is, is a lot of people that's gonna be watching this. I encourage if Anybody like is a, you know, a, a therapist or like a guidance counselor or, you know, somebody that can can mediate this situation outside. We don't of need me. no media. We don't need no I media. I said mediation, sir. Media mean camera. Mediation means help. You get what I'm saying? I understand. Because she hurt. I so what she needs to do first, she got to fix her first. She got to fix her first before she can even be cool with you walk to the park with you or anything, she got to fix her first. She heard it, and we all been seeing it, and we all know. So she got to fix her first before she can fuck with you. 100%. And that's, that's I'm, like I said, I'm not no therapist. I'm not no therapist, but I see what I see. And she hurt. It's my baby She girl, hurt, man. and like she said, you wasn't there for a lot of the shit that happened to her. So you to blame, too. And that's how she feel. And you got to take that on the chin. Oh, no, no, no. I take it on both. You got to take it and you're taking it. So what I'm saying is, and what I'm asking for is cash. You already know. You already know. You already know. You need to talk to somebody. You need to let that shit out. You doing what you doing? Keep doing it. I tell you all the time. I hit you up. I tell you good things. You feel me? And I do that out the kindness of my heart. But it's gonna be somebody that's gonna see this. And I'm gonna manifest that they're gonna hit you up. They're gonna hit you up and they're gonna help you. And when I mean help, I don't mean you you crazy. I mean because you hurt. You hurting. It's a lot of people hurting, but it's okay. And somebody gonna help you. And that's gonna be that. So when she get, let her heal. Let her heal. Communicate how she let you communicate. But let her heal. Yeah, for sure. She got to heal. I ain't going nowhere. So, y'all, before I get to, like, really crying and shit, I'm about to end this show, you guys. Um, thank you for tuning in to The Liddy Show. Um, I'm going to let Cash see the content that I did with her father before I drop it. So, 
tune in to this live and if you see the content that means it was cash approved so y'all have a blessed night thank y'all for tuning in to the liddy show and i'll see y'all next monday